Hey, it's me. So, I'm in an empty room with a big box. It's very dirty, too. Well, if you watched my video last week, um, you would know that I am moving. Well, I've moved, actually. This is the new place. <laughs> Isn't it lovely? It's a wall. It's actually very wonderful. I can be as loud as I want. Oh! Because nobody lives on the top floor, well, besides us, but, you know. Woo! It's great! Since we rented a basement before, um, you know, I always had to be worried about, like, bothering people upstairs. I was still pretty loud, but in the back of my mind, I'm always like, ooh. Am I annoying? Are they, like, about to come down and murder me? So, yes, it's very nice to feel free and relaxed. I've been shouting since I got here. <laughs> Fantabulous! I'm gonna have to adjust the sound on this video, aren't I? We've gotten a lot done as far as moving in, but there's still a lot to be done. Bear with me, be patient, be caring, be loving, be understanding, just, just be nice. Anyway, I'm just gonna be setting up this space here into a little space that I can film at and just kind of sit and, you know, chill, whatever. <laughs> this big beast, is actually supposed to be a little couch. A big beast. Of a little couch. <laughs> I bought this on Amazon and the reviews were mixed. Some people were not loving it. Um, but I'm really hoping that this works. We'll see. I did get new yoga pants. Uh, I had been wearing my old ones for seven years, but I'm not sure if I'm liking these. They're so like satiny. I kind of feel like I'm wearing dress slacks and I'm not, I'm not sure if I'm about it, but also the pockets make it look dressy. It's time to open this box. Scissors. Yeah, let me not put that in my eye. It's a nice couch. It's comfortable. All right. Who chose this tacky blue for a couch? That's so immature. Leave me alone, okay? Oh! It's, it's definitely blue. I did see in the review, some people said it was like sitting on a rock. Pretty soft rock. Cushion number one. Cushion number two. This is the daddy. Yeah, it's a, this is a furniture right here. Oh, okay. Let me, I'm sweating. Ah, don't fall. Beep, 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 beep. Oh my gosh. Let's just kind of move everyone out of the way. How much assembly is gonna be required of this? Because that's not really my thing. Oh. hardware. Oh, they gave us a little snack. Let's figure out how to put this thing together. Yikes. Why don't they use words? I think we need to flip this over. Where's the backrest? Is it this? Ah, ha, ha, oh no. Is this the backrest? Cause that is tiny. No, wait, what is this? Ah, ah. Not you. You. What is that? What is that? I'm concerned that this might be like a child's couch because it is incredibly small. So we have our little bag of, you know, knickknacks. I feel like with assembly instructions like this, they just assume that you know what all these things are and what they're for, which is fine, unless you don't know what all of this is. And then you're just, uh, you know, s screwed. Is this a screw? Anyway, it's just a uh, very vague looking diagrams. I don't know what any of this means. I can't sit up straight in this box. I would say it's reasonable to assume that this goes like that. Yeah, yeah. I think that you are meant to just kind of like that. Mm -hmm. I've been working on the railroad all the live long day. Just kind of shimmy shaky that down. I believe you have to secure it on the bottom because as of now, you know. Oh my gosh. You like my slacks? What is going on in here? So now we have these things. These I'm pretty sure you just use to secure the little screws in there. So... 
Oh, you need a wrench. this would take the average person to do. Wrench! Got it. It's gorgeous! I don't think that that is really what's supposed to be happening here. Let me have a look-see under the hood. Um, yeah! I think that something is wrong. Okay, so for some reason the ones in the middle are just fine but the ones on the ends will not tighten down no matter what I do. Actually, that's a lot more stable than it was. I'm gonna go with that. What's next? These are the arms. The arms are the same kind of situation. Yay, I'm so excited. It goes like that. I feel like the arms are actually more important to have on there securely than the back because the back is going to be like up against the wall anyway, so like if it falls off, but this is going to be like, so if this falls off, I fall to my death, likely. I feel like that's a little bit better, right? You can see what's going on now. I wouldn't want you to miss this. This is quality entertainment right here. That's my favorite part. Okay, so the last step is the feet. The feet. Here are the feet. Size six, looks like. Good. How's it going? It's going just fine. It's just perfect. I am a very capable person. And you're not frustrated. And the fact that you assume that I need your help is frankly offensive. Well, I was struggling, but it's actually fine now. I did it! Thank you. Thank you. Ow! <laughs> you like that color? Yeah. <laughs> nice slacks. <laughs> Shut up. What the heck? Oh, okay. It goes like this. Structured, I will say that. I like it. Oh, look, they gave you a free blanket. Are you sleeping? Are you sleeping, brother? That was nice of them. I also got a little side table and a little ottoman. Let's uh, let's get to those now. Come here. Do you like the couch? <laughs> Do you like the couch? Ah. Uh, all right. Here's the table. <laughs> and this is a little ottoman. Wow, it's like bigger than the couch. Whoa! This inner part of the drawer was supposed to be like a tan. So they were supposed to kind of match each other, but as you can see, they don't match at all. But that's okay. I guess it doesn't really matter, but you know. So I'm gonna go hunt and find some things that we can use to spice up this area a little bit because this is not cutting it for me. I found this. This is a beautiful little jar I got from a thrift store years ago. This could work. I found this pillow. 
we've got blue. We've got whatever that color is. This is actually a pillowcase I customized. That works. Aha. Uh -huh. This. Look at that. You. And introducing this. You would look good down there. You know, if I know myself, I will only continue to add excessive amounts of stuff in this small space, so that'll come later. But there is one more thing I wanted to do. Since I had all of it on my desk before, I wanna put artwork that you guys have sent to me on the wall. I printed out some digital art that you guys have emailed to me, so. I have no clue where my real metal ruler is. It's yet to be unpacked. Literally decorated this in first grade. artwork that you guys have actually sent to me. So let me go through and pick out some, not playing favorites, but you know. I tried to pick out stuff that like has, you know, my channel vibe in it. Like it has stuff like channel references, video references, or like specifically things that have to do with my channel. So let's start decorating. Wow, I actually fit a ton of art up here. I didn't even have a fraction of this on display before, so I'm glad. We have a lot more uh, a real estate for artwork here, so that's good. This makes me feel a little narcissistic <laughs> because there's like, there's uh, my face. My face is everywhere and my name is everywhere, but that's just that's just the stuff that people send me. So, it's cool. I love it. You guys make some really nice looking artwork, so thanks for that. I'm officially committed. Y'all can't leave me at this point. Cuz then what am I going to do with this? What am I going to do with this if you guys leave me? Please don't leave me. But anyway, if you want to send me some artwork to go on my new wall, then you can. Uh, there's an email address in the description that's dedicated to artwork, so if you want to send it, send it there. Usually I use that for create this book entries, but if you want to send just random art there, you can. Not random art, like... I'm probably not gonna put like a random drawing of a toad on the wall, you know? Like, if it's related to my channel. It is nighttime. It's nighttime. Next week, things will go back to normal and I'll do one of my normal series, hopefully. Unless something happens. See you next Friday. Bye.